This art object was a blue and white Chinese porcelain dish with delicate flower motifs and a scalloped border. It doesn't have a title, but we know it derives from Jingdezhen, China, although the artist beyond that is not further known. The dish is designed in a finely blue cobalt design, um, originally from the years of 1403 to 1424, around the 15th century. It has a cobalt blue design that originates from this one single flower in the centre of the plate and then this establishes into different spaced flowers and leaves. It was mostly to be used as um, a diplomatic gift. It was made of porcelain which was a very, very expensive material at the time. It has influences from the Middle East because of the trading and um, actually the cobalt blue colour was transported from Iran to China and this influenced Chinese artists to also put these designs into their artwork. In a museum today, it still largely serves an ornamental decorative function as something for uh, gallery goers to view. Porcelain like this was highly prized both by European and Ottoman nobles and was an object of vast status though I think a lot of that cultural context has really changed today. So why is it relevant today? We think that, you know, it's housed currently in the Jamil Gallery in the V&A, and, you know, it's very easy to go and see it. I think it's a really beautiful work of art. But further beyond that, I think it reveals a lot about a particular time and the kind of global roots and connections between different countries. For that reason, we can think about it as a larger way to examine art and history and how art used for political purposes can often be very connected. So, in conclusion, looking at this work, not only is it a really beautiful slice in time from this particular culture, but I think it also shows us how intertwined politics and art can be.